Three, two, one, and go. Yet. Shorten it to 10 seconds. <laughs> Turn off stream now before anyone gets a chance. <laughs> How you doing, man? It's Wednesday, my dudes. I don't know if I'm feeling particularly motivated or not. Today, we'll see. That much work? Yeah, I know the feeling. Okay, thanks for the host, dude. Oh, my man. Andromon is having an argument with her friends about who could beat up who. It's getting very animated. And heated. Her voice raised about three octaves. Hence <laughs> my look of confusion. <laughs> Pure. Fine. Fine. Okay. 
Okay. <laughs> uh, 70. Oh no, 69. Nice. <laughs> nice. All right. <laughs> All right, give me a wear hair. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's not. Uh. Yo, Pedantic, how's it going? Also, how's it going, school? Thanks, guys. And shame it was at the six minute mark, but I will still absolutely take it. Oh? What notifications? Also, I moved in a particular manner for that uh, bumper shoot parasol encounter because that spot that I moved to is usually where you take two damage. So I was right. I got lucky with the two damage. Amada GBA? Ooh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can believe it. What's the... Is that the, the black GBA I saw with a, with a black... with a backlight? I saw that got retweeted earlier today. Yo, that thing's sick, dude. Nicely done. Ready for some more retweets? <laughs> Yo, Kazi, how's it going, my dude? Yes, dear. I'm streaming, by the way. That's okay. I was listening to some of it, but I wasn't paying close attention. I said you were just gonna argue with them until they they did. Uh, there's not enough people. I mean, you can if you want to. Get to dab and cry, dear. I am already dabbing and crying. I want more encounter, actually. Yeah, we're just gonna go for it. Hopefully, we don't get a cobalt, which we will assuredly get. Dab away, tears. Anyway, I have a question. <laughs> Cake just took a life right there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> anyway. Uh, nice three. Question for chat. 69. Could you kick? My ass. I'm seriously asking. <laughs> One of my friends had like a a mutual meme thing of put your put people on a chart and then the chart is would you be able to kick their ass or I could kick their ass and would you wanna fight or don't wanna fight? And my friend of years says he could kick my ass. And I'm like, no! He cannot kick my ass. Now everybody's all like, yeah, we can totally kick your ass, Andro. And I'm like, come on. So I'm asking, I'm asking random people, I know you guys. Yo, Andre, but... how's it going, dude? And yes, first dupe, and it was a god dupe with a parasol mummer shoot. It oh, was a, job. it was a 69. Sure. Thank you. God, I hope this PB is so that all the comments for the YouTube video are just nice. Nice. <laughs> nice. It may be a timestamp to the dupe. <laughs> or one comment will be a timestamp with the word nice and everyone will reply to that with nice. Hey, Demon Flip. How's it going, dude? 
Switch the I and the E. Did I put it backwards? Hi. Oh, hi. Hi, everybody. I, I love you guys. You guys come and support my fiance. I appreciate it. But also, I can kick everybody's asses. Oh my god, woman. <laughs> Yo, if if ever if <laughs> oh, I'm ever on the meme that if you can, you can or cannot kick my ass, I better be on the cannot side. Just say, don't laugh. I didn't even kick your ass. I'm sure he didn't. Okay, if you don't have an ass, you're exempt from. Me. <laughs> oh, you're fine, you. Now she's gonna kick my butt. <laughs> they ate her. Now they're gonna eat me too. Oh my god. If everyone's familiar with Trolls 2, the movie about goblins. <laughs> yeah, he was working in SpongeBob. I thought you liked SpongeBob, Patrick. I did, but I was also. It made me think of the Trolls quote, because that one's funny. I feel like my MP's a little low, so I'm just... The hash thing is it. The mash banging? The, the bash bringing? The, the... Mash minging? We're also gonna go right here because it's not good to uh, go in and out once more. Hello? We got this nice and early actually. That's just... You know what's funnier than 24? 69! 420! The SpongeBob reference! What the hell are you talking about? 25! I know! Come on! Joke. Now I get to give you shit for not knowing a SpongeBob reference. I wasn't even. I just reference. I can kick your ass. <laughs> okay. This is entrapment? <laughs> it's not even. I trust everybody to make the correct choice that I could kick things at. No, just biased. Oh, correct choice. I ain't uh -huh. saying shit about bias. Okay. The correct choice is that I can kick your butt. Domestic dispute. Something like that. I don't think this kills him. Nice, Celine's Bell, that's what I want. Yes, Demon, I actually also speedrun it. I have the second best time. Vice. Vice the Legend? Oh, the guy who comes. Yeah, he's really good at it. I'm also not good at it. And I'm alright at it, but I also didn't, uh, I didn't grind it super hard when I got pretty good at it. 
I don't know. I don't enjoy that run a whole lot. I like it kind of. Kind of like a every once in a while type of run, but like I can't grind it. Boom! Bienvenue, idiot. With silly over the top French accentuation, like, by all means. You... I could. Do it. Bienvenue, oh. idiot. A guy from the West and Bamboo on the art asked to art on it. Oh, nice. Alright, encounter. Come on. That was. Solid 15 seconds slower than I want it to be. And he just. Alright, well, we're not saving time on this split. Cool, I think you and I are the only people that get that. Because Marsh isn't here. <laughs> Ugh, that was gross. Streets 112. Is that the thing where he goes in the bathtub or, or the, the, uh, the washer? washer. Two minutes to the door. That is terrible. <laughs> it's really bad. And our MP is a little low. Hopefully, post um, Nefty, the, the walk to the boat pool. All the encounters will have a bunch of enemies that'll make up for it a little bit. but that was quite the decision I just made there, which was probably arguably the right one. I don't know. Probably not. Made up the MP. Somewhat. We're in a better spot. We should get 17 very early in here. So how's everyone's week so far? Ugh, that's fair cake. That's what my week's kind of like that too. You're sick of Chromebooks? Okay, fair. That's, They're everywhere. I'm working with some Chromebooks too. My biggest issue is uh, we use a ConnectWise control to connect the machines, and it, for Chromebooks, the control app does not let you control it. You can only look at it. So you have to walk the users through what's going on, and some of the users are uh, crotchety old men who don't want to follow your directions. It's fun!
I'm looking at your screen, my guy! It's right there! Press, press the Windows key on your keyboard. How more does it between control and alt in the bottom left? You gotta gotta find all the different ways to say the same thing. I do, I, I did. I'd be like, hey, we. Hey, we. This. This. Maybe the, the backspace above the enter key. Oh no, it's complete I'm school. Good. I'm I'm playing glitchless. Hooray. Oh no. Oh, you reached the goal? I, I didn't reach the goal. You all reached it. You all did this to me. I think, damn. I think. So when I'm salty, <laughs> the entire time I'm doing glitchless, just know it's your fault. <laughs> ah, this is a really terrible walk. Cool. I'm not salty about this at all. This walk is terrible. I've already lost a minute and 20. It's going to be at least a minute and a half. I mean, we can get this time back, but that's that sucks to lose that kind of time. That doesn't surprise me, Kazi. I mean, I unsatisfactory, like yeah. Only if it's not sub 120. Done a quick bit. Yeah, I'm zoomed out, so I can't see shit. Try to zoom back in. Really? I'm not out? Excuse me, game. Counters at least put like seven enemies in it. Or one. That's also fine. Thanks, Quest. Love you too. Probably. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, Kazi. Considering my last uh, world record run was prior to the one this May was two years ago, I don't really remember. I know. I, I think I was satisfied with a couple of them here and there, like pre-death dupe. I think that the one pre-death dupe I was okay with. Or pre, and also maybe the one pre-agility glitch. But I don't remember. I never honestly thought I'd be knocking on the door of a sub-120. You, you got it! I don't expect anything, I'm just disappointed no matter what. Spicy water. Please. Thanks, babe. Refuse. Mine, please. Thank you. Not you. Don't make me. <laughs> oh, right. Um, we call seltzer water spicy water. Hey, that's what we have, Zach. That's what we're using. Yeah, sorry, I forgot that I haven't talked about this before. We ca we call seltzer water spicy water. There's a there's a video or something somewhere where a child called seltzer water spicy because they didn't have they don't know enough words. And so we stole that. Yay, glitchless! And there was much rejoicing. 
Yeah. Yeah, that walk actually wasn't half bad. Save some time. Take that. Do do do. Do do do. Could have been a bit better, but you know, I'll take it. Almost halfway to ninety. Or 19. Wish I had 90 MP. Yeah, no goats. Certainly helps. We didn't get a silence flute, but that's. We already got a ceiling spell, so. Getting a silence flute would have just been. Would have been a bonus. And we're almost certainly gonna have to do the out of bounds encounter. We're gonna have. We're gonna have like 58 agility, maybe. We might have to do even a second out of bounds. Can you open that one more time? Then you can close it. I just want that spritz. Cause that always sprays water everywhere. Thank you. I appreciate you. <laughs> What'd she say? <laughs> All right, uh, that's agility glitch. Hey, Guptina. Gonna write, how are you? I took that for MP. Every little bit right now. 12 minute out of bounds, that great. We had a, a nice dupe. Nice even 69. We've also hit 200k, so I'm gonna be doing glitchless. Soon. Yep. <clears throat> I don't even know what I'm... Ugh, I don't even know what the route is. I, I, like, I vaguely know what the route is. Let me rephrase that. I vaguely know what the route is. It's gonna take a lot of effort for me not to accidentally frickin' do agility glitch. Cause I'm gonna be habitually just, like, hitting A and Z as I try to enter an encounter. At least the first encounters, like once you get past the beginning, whatever. Yeah, 
Sorry, I'm not super talkative. I really wasn't expecting the first run to uh, be anything. It usually doesn't happen. The good enough dupe where I'm actually kind of focusing. focuses these days. Nerds, that's who. Dab, got him. Exactly. Nerds. Next time I should wear like a, uh, one of my Uniforms from the game from one of the teams I used to play for. Like, really go all out against the nerds. Nice five. Make up for that three earlier. there. Alright, we're, we're in a good spot for MP, actually. Pretty good spot. If that's 19, so that's pretty normal. Please let me out of the encounter. Cool. Scream for Scream to. Thank you. Thank you, Scream. Appreciate you for that one. All those rocks, though, are just right next to him. Slightly to the left. Nice. He's gonna walk. Oh, he didn't. Alright, well, we're gonna change that position. One. Just one. Ah, come on. Don't walk, don't walk, don't walk. Alright, he's dead. Not the end of the world, just not, you know, happy either. Actually, kind of does. They got the gray hair and the. And it has a little more wild gray hair, but pretty similar. Alright, flush goes the Laura pool. I think you're the first person that's made that connection. <laughs> well done. You're probably also the only other person that remembers anything about that game besides me, unfortunately. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, that's referring to the game. Um, Xander the Monster more for another game I run. If you got if you picked up the uh, Black Lives Matter Itchio bundle way back earlier this year, you have that game. I always suggest you play it, it's a lot of fun. This probably won't work, but let's see. I'll be damned. We had just enough space to set that up. We were up against the edge. <laughs> that was, uh, yeah, that was 
damn near perfect. So, um, that gold is not surprising. Not much of a gold, but it's a gold. <laughs> That's fair, Andre. Means you were one of the ones listening. Appreciate that. Hello? Oh wow, I went way past that. That's not bad. the end of the world. Lost waste in three seconds, but that's whatever. Yeah, my sum of best is stupid. <laughs> like, I still haven't gotten a perfect, like, a perfect, perfect bogus fight and a perfect, perfect, um, guilty fight. I also haven't had a perfect, uh, Maimon's world. I have had a perfect, nearly perfect Mammon. That last fight Mammon was like one spell cast different from being perfect. If you use Spirit Bomb every single turn and you don't die and you get to cast Avalanche every single turn, that would be perfect. But like, that boss fight was as good as it's going to get for a human without sitting there, resetting, and trying it over and over and over again, you know? Stupid. It'll probably be like 20 or 230. Usually like 228. Oh. oh, we're doing glitchless. God, that, that blue banner just. Like getting kicked in the shins or something, you know? <laughs> um. Hmm. The question for you guys do you want it to be like a normal week stream, like this, where I do glitchless? No, that's not fair. I feel like it needs to be a weekend. I do like an eight-hour thing. I give it the full time it deserves. Uh, but is is this Saturday too soon? Does that give people enough time to know that I'm going to suffer? One week notice, so like next weekend. We gotta prepare. I mean. The aim. The aim. Oh, so the whole thing with that glitchless thing is I'm gonna give it a real try, not just me being like, I don't know, this is close enough to the glitchless route. Haha, <laughs> I did glitchless and never do it again. I wanted to give it a serious go. So the eight hours is so that I can do, uh, like, actually figure out what the route is because I don't know, and then also give it some serious attempts because it's it's not really, it's not going to take me a whole lot to learn it because I know the game well enough as it is, but it's more a matter of things I need to pick up, um, fights I need to take, spirits I would pick up that I normally wouldn't hear, you know, all that fun stuff. Boss fights, I mean, are going to be similar. I can use confusion and stuff. I can be more aggressive since we'll be doing a defense grind, all that fun stuff. All right, no fish sticks. All right, well. That was a fun run. I guess I'll reset now. <sighs> Rude. Yeah. It does make it a lot shorter. Really? Frickin' fish stick, dude. I have the high ground. Two? Okay. Still have the high ground. 
Really? Okay. That was a five avalanche where three of them hit, two of them missed. <laughs> that was that fight, dude. Yeah, right? I mean, that 30 second time save is now a 30 second time loss because of having to, having gotten fish sticks. Oh, that's way it goes. So, for the agility route, when we get to the Isle of Sky, we either have 70 or 71 agility. And the Termants and the Thunder Gels have 32-ish agility. A Pixie has 70 agility, and the Fish Stick has 75. And if we get the Fish Stick encounter, it ruins the agility route, so we have to double dip, like I'm about to do here. So you lose a minute. I don't want to see them, or I lose time. So what I'm about to do here, go back out to uh, the Isle of Sky, this is our time loss. This, and then having to go back to the end of Blue Cave. That's why we do not want to see the Grangok, or Fish Stick, as it were. Yeah, it's just because they're faster than us. They have 75 agility. Getting that extra 5 agility is just... would take a minute. Not worth it. Please don't move. I can't agility glitch if he's faster than me. That's why. I lose out on four-ish agility because of him. I have to be faster than the encounter to do an agility glitch. And like going out of our yeah, going out of our way to get that extra five agility is basically the same amount of time as getting that encounter. So what is the agility glitch? If you're faster than the enemy that you get into an encounter with, you can end your turn before the encounter fully loads. I'm going to do it right here. Watch the A and Z buttons in the controller cam at the bottom. I did it. So what the game thinks happened is that I moved from whatever my previous in coordinates of a battle to whatever my current coordinates are in a battle, and that holds over between maps. So I went from the end of Blue Cave, which is a really big number, to the Isle of Sky, which is a really small number, so I got a huge amount of agility as if I move that far. That's why. Three minutes. That's... I should be on the boat in, like, 15 seconds. That's not good. That, well, I mean, it nearly does, because it's just the matter is you have to be faster, and if you start with a wear hair, it's pretty easy to be faster than everything as you continuously go. The only good thing about having to do that walk now is we get a little bit of extra MP. I'm already at 20. Please stop lagging. So I should have been on the boat about a minute ago. So we only, we didn't lose actually a lot of extra time, we still really only lost like a minute, so that's it. It doesn't reset the glitch state, it's just that they're faster, that's it. Literally only because they're faster, so we can't do an agility glitch like normal. There is no glitch state, it's just that if you're faster than the enemy, you can skip your turn. That's it. You can see if the turn before the encounter fully loads, that is. Um... 
We're not going to go for it. As much as I want to go for it, I'm not going to go for it. I maybe should have, but I don't know, man. Tough to say. Cool. Mm. I'm not frustrated. You're frustrated. Yeah, we're gonna lose a bunch of fucking time here. Cool. Give me a singular wyvern, please. So the issue is it takes us off of it's it's not for the encounter itself, it's for the entire agility route. We lose out on five agility. So that we have to what what happens is if we if we get that the correct encounter before Nefty, we can go to the we'll have um we'll go from seventy we'll go to about seventy-five agility. We will go to the end of Blue Cave, we'll have seventy-nine agility. The first encounter we take outside of Blue Cave will have 83 or 84 agility, and we need 84 here. We missed that... Ah, two minutes. Ugh. We missed that encounter before Nepti. We're now at 70 agility, so we have to go into the end of Blue Cave to get to 75, go back out to Isle of Sky to get to 70... Um, uh, 79, and then we have to go back into the end of Blue Cave because the Isle of Sky is a low number, and if we go to... Uh, the next area, it's also a low number, so we wouldn't get enough. So we had to go back into the end of Blue Cave and get up to 83. So we're going to have more agility than we normally would, but it's how we get back onto the agility route. Because we need to have 84 before this area, because the fastest enemy is a ghost, which has 84 agility. Like, I got lucky there and I determined, so if I didn't have 84 agility, it wouldn't have been the end of the world. But, um, you gotta have it. Just in case. Therein lies the problem, right? It's about the agility route. Not the... Not, like, necessarily how much time I lose for not doing it. It's the bigger picture, if you will. Of course, I haven't... I... The, the, yeah, this is part of why I haven't written the notes, because there's, like, a bunch of... I feel like there's a bunch of different little things I have to put together... Or a bunch of, like, I need to write out what the agility route is. And then after I write the agility route, I need to write the out-of-bounds stuff, because they wrote, they're part of, like, agility routing. And... And then I have to do, like, death dupe has to be its own, obviously has to be its own thing, and then, like, the spirit route post-death dupe is its own thing. And then just, like, the general where you go, aside from glitches route is its own thing, and, like, you could put it all together, but, like, you need to know some of it preemptively, if you will, like, feels like, feels like part of it I have to do just separately, that's all. And then I just have to make the, like, videos, like, this is how you do this out of bounds with this much agility, like, this is what it looks like. This is the spot you look at. Granted, the out of bounds stuff, I could be, like, take a picture right here, walk into that corner, Make sure you're using this line as a point of reference for that much agility. Call Hazard and Blue Cave are really easy. Boil Hole is mostly easy. The issue is your your agility can vary depending on... Like, we got a fish stick, so we're going to have way more agility than we normally would. So I'm going to have to step further down. 
they'll probably have to do two pictures, one with assuming you got a fish stick and your agility route is exact, or one where you didn't get a fish stick where your agility route is you're a little bit higher than you normally would be. And then I have to, I'd have to make a video for this whole thing. Three, two, one, drop. That was really bad. <laughs> that was really, really bad. I thought I was further up, so I tried to go lower. I was wrong. <laughs> Oof. Oof, ouch, owie. Yo, Lena, how's it going? Yep. Do indeed. Uh, I need to... I need to know what the actual, like, route is, because I don't know. Cool. <laughs> oh, Don, how's it going? Incorrect. I need to- I need- I need an encounter before Nepti, and it needs to not be fish stick, so any of the other three enemies is fine. But if I get fish stick, it ruins it. What happens is my previous encounter point is at the end of Blue Cave, which is like 100-100 for the sake of argument, and Isla Sky is like 0-0. If I get a fish stick, I don't get to do the agility glitch, my my previous encounter point gets set to 0-0, so if I were to do another encounter, I wouldn't get much agility. However, if any other encounter happened before fish stick, I could do an agility glitch and the game would think I moved from 100-100 to 0-0 and I would get that agility. Oh damn, pretty good walk. Saving time is a good thing there. Gotta be close to 21 MP. Yeah, we're... Ooh, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I realize sometimes I don't necessarily explain things perfectly well. If I, if I need to clarify, let me know. And I also know, like, when I started running this game, I already actually knew a fair bit about it. So, like, I forget not everyone comes in with the, the wealth of knowledge I had. Ah. Yeah, it's just, it's, if you, if they're faster than you, you can't do it. And that's really all it is. We're at 21 MP, which is ridiculous. Yeah, Tony. I really should not have done five days. I should have done... I should have extended it one day. We're, we're pretty... I pretty much guaranteed that we're gonna do it. That was... Whatever. Now y'all get to fuck me supper, so... You know, have fun. So what's happening? We'll probably we'll probably do it like next Saturday. I'll do a full day of suffering. We'll probably start at like noon or something, maybe 1 p.m. and go to late. <laughs> right. I mean, you could still always make me switch cards if you really wanted to. Come on, game, come on. You can't do me like that. Let me just let me just save time. Like I think that's a uh, okay, I would say maybe that was the first sub two minute walk and it wasn't. I haven't been had a sub two minute walk in a long time. 
<laughs> I mean, that's fair. I should agility glitch this. Alright, so I have a Celine's Bell. I'm going to use it. Assuming I get a wrong encounter. 97 agility? Okay. If that fails, then I will then use a Ceiling's Bell. I probably should have used a Ceiling's Bell anyway, but that's not enough. Oh, yeah. That was actually really... I haven't seen that angle. Usually it's a lot bigger. That was really good. I'll take it. Thankfully, they just used Silence, so it didn't matter that I didn't use a Ceiling's Bell. It was probably faster. I think... The ceiling's bell is a bit laggier than casting. No. Nope. That's not when I split. It's cool. I split over here. I split when the area below me, the bottom left corner, disappears, because then it's exactly a minute 14. So when I split right there... A minute 14 from now. I mean, I didn't lose time. I will take that. That was really good. I don't think that gold split's possible anymore because of how the out of bounds is done now. But I'm not gonna take it out because I could. I could still, if I get like, I really should if I get the two uh, or single um, magma fish encounter at the very beginning, I should I should take that encounter and use that for out of bounds, because it is possible to be much faster than doing what I did, even though what I did is consistent, but it's further down. But yeah, minute 14, we'll get into an encounter. glitch for the extra bit of agility. seconds overall take it means the walk to oil hole itself wasn't terrible <laughs> for once usually it's pretty bad Okay, from now on I think I'm just gonna grab all three items in this room. Those two ceilings bell and the replica. If I survive I can I can run forward and use them. We don't have to cast any spells for the walk to Guilty. I'm also not going to clone this one spirit that I usually clone. Can you go for it? Bum, 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 bum. 
if this becomes a sub 120 run, if that means that these this, these last three splits are gonna be ridiculous, because there's so much time save early on in this run that is just not happening. Challenge. Is that next weekend? Maybe we'll make Glitchless my 12 hour challenge. <laughs> In which case, I have to do 12 hours of suffering. Granted, I'll probably learn it. A lot of a lot of the difference is gonna be decision making and stuff. Yeah, that's next weekend, isn't it? Yeah, the issue is the games that are released in my birth year are either games that I really don't like, or things like Final Fantasy X, which is a 10-hour run. <laughs> but my birthday is in July, and there are not a whole lot of uh, games in July games I want to learn. Elltail Monsters. If, if you're born in July, Elltail Monsters. Yeah. You learn <laughs> Quest 64. <laughs> Silly dude. That was a silly walk. Yeah, no shit, that was a gold. Okay. Oh, don't walk. Thank you. One. Pretty good. 
15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Thank you, Quest. Green, thank you. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Alright. Never. Yo, Heiner, how's it going, my dude? Oh, that was dumb. Hey, good luck, dude. How you doing, man? Pretty all right. Pretty all right. I'm not gonna pick up the spirit, but I will get the item over here. ready with your FFZ emotes because I'm a chest finally called dad but hi dad bye dad yo hobo how's it going dude Time save is good, time save. Uh, my heartbeat's pretty big. Pretty big heartbeat right now. Oh. Ah, pretty high is the, I can't even think. <clears throat> Words are hard, all right? Hey, Landmine. He's dead.
All right. Thank you, Scream. I'm probably not going to look at chat. Shakes it set up just in case. If we die to Shakes it, I will YOLO Mammon. Or not, if we die and have to use Shakes it, I will YOLO Mammon. Some hey band, how's it going, dude? <laughs> Probably only like this room. <laughs> hey Momo, how's it going? worried about these guys. I will take my time and use as much of their encounter within reason. best spot you can get to that encounter because of that reason. Okay. Six encounters. None of them were terrible.
I'm glad you love him too, Goo. He's friend-shaped, after all, as a gunman. I'm trying to breathe slowly to slow down my heart rate. <laughs> Okay, okay. Okay, okay. I want to go for it. But I know it won't end well this time. Oh, I forgot to split. going for it. Yo, let's fucking go! Yes! Fuck yes! Ah! Ah! Holy shit! <laughs> Sorry for screaming. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> my heart is racing and I'm shaking. <laughs> oh my god, hell yeah. Fuck yeah. Yo, Heiner. Thank you. <laughs> and Pedantic, thank you for the 250 bits. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't even, like... Super happy for you. <laughs> I'm almost gonna start crying. Ooh. Hell yeah, dude. Oh my god. Yo, Tony. And Don, thank you for the... the, uh, the sub as well. Tony, thank you for the five. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> uh, ooh. Thank you, Don. Welcome to Bing's Wings. Uh, thank you for the support. Congrats, Kate. Cake, Sarah, Mermaid, Dawn, and Lucky. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Fuck yes, man. Fuck yes. 
Oh. Yo, Vice. Thanks for the 1,000 bits, dude. Thank you. Hey, Demon. Hey, ever uh, for everyone I didn't say hi to, thank you. <laughs> and hello. Yo, Zach, for the, thanks for the five subs. Congrats, Tuller, Goop, him, Cotton, and Doug. Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck yeah, guys. Fuck yeah. Congrats on the end <sighs> run. That was... Oh my god. <laughs> uh, ooh. Yo, Kazi. Uh, I'm gonna lose my voice. <laughs> uh, I need to yell again. Mm. Oh, Kazi, thank you for the five gifts. Congrats, Eternal, Basara, Lina, Dark, and Shadow. It's still, it does have still shameful red split, so this shit ain't done. But, it's a sub-120, dude. I'm sh I'm shaking. <laughs> uh -huh. I've never seen a 121 and never fucking will. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, Fire Prince, thank you for the, the sub. Welcome to Shamwood. Ugh. Danik, thank you for the 300 bits. Oh my god. I, like, I can't. <laughs> I'm, uh. I'm just gonna repeat myself a bunch. I'm fucking overwhelmed. Uh. <laughs> Drama is running downstairs. Ugh. <laughs> uh. It happened! What? It fucking happened. What? what? <laughs> it happened. Oh my god, I missed it! You fucking bitch! I'm... How are you gonna get- How are you gonna get someone to want me being here? You're in- You're in Rule spirit. Rule as shit! Rule Yo, Zach. AF! <laughs> Thank you for so the gifts of the landmine. So the so hold on. Let me let me walk through it. The walk the walk to Boil Hole was good and I saved 20 seconds. And then I didn't lose any additional time in the out of bounds or the walk to the end. Like, did you get any bites? Huh? Did you get any bites? Like any pinheads? I did, I got one pinhead. Oh no! Yes! <laughs> but I got it in the perfect spot where I can dodge his attacks. <laughs> I can't believe I missed it! I'm what? I'm about to watch.